How to let go of the past and start anew. It's hard to forget the pain of the past, the heartache, the betrayal, the disappointment. But hanging on to that pain only makes things worse. It keeps you from moving forward and living at your full potential. Hello there. My name is Nordin Zwareg. I'm a two-time Mr. Universe, a best-selling author, and an international high-performance coach. In this video, I'm going to show you how to let go of the past and start anew. Before we start, however, please like and subscribe so others can benefit from videos like this one. We've all been there. We've all felt the sharp sting of betrayal or the ache of a broken heart which is only driven by fear. And it's not fun, let me tell you. But what's even less fun is holding on to that pain and let it rule your life. Trust me, I know from experience. I used to be a person who wallowed in my misery, reliving every hurt over and over again in my head. But then I realized that hanging on to the pain was only making th things worse for me. It was keeping me from moving forward and living to my full potential. So I let it go. And you know what? I'm happier because of it. Now, I'm not saying that forgetting the past is easy, but it is possible with a little awareness and effort. So if you're struggling to let go of the pain of your past, just remember that it's holding you back. To start anew, you need to let go of the old, Forgive those who have hurt you and move on. When you let go of the past, you make room for a new beginning. As I said earlier, we all have baggage from our past, whether it's lingering anger towards an ex, resentment towards a family member, or grief over a lost loved one. We all have something that weighs us down. And often, we hold on to these things because we are afraid to let go. We are afraid that if we let go of the pain, we also let go of the, of the memories. But what if I told you that you could have both? That you could let go of the pain and keep the happy memories. It sounds impossible, I know, but it's not. Forgiving those who have hurt you is a process. But it's a process that starts with an open mind and a gentle heart. Once you're aware of the negative thoughts and emotions that are holding you back, you can now let them go. It won't happen overnight, but each time you let go of one hurt, you make room for new experience in your life. We all have moments in our lives when we feel stuck, like we've trapped, we are trapped in a situation that we can't escape from. It's important to remember that we always have the power to let go of what's holding us back and move on to something better. The past is behind us, and that is for a reason. It's time to live in the present and look to the future with hope. Yes. Things might be tough right now, but that doesn't mean that they always be that way. Sometimes all it takes is a change of perspective to see the beauty in life again. If we can learn to focus on the here and now, we'll be less likely to dwell on negative thoughts about the past or worry about the future. Instead, we can just enjoy the moment and be grateful for what we have. When we let go of what's dragging us down, we open ourselves up to new possibilities. So my friends, let go of what's holding you back. Live in the present and look to the future with hope. The past is behind you. It's time to start anew. I hope this video was very helpful. Please like, comment, and subscribe. If you are interested in hiring me for private coaching, speaking engagement, or to experience an amazing wellness retreat at top award-winning resort spas, please visit my website at nordinezwareg.com. And remember, 
There can be no true and long-lasting fitness without inner fitness. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video.